Hello. I'm here early, like I said. Do I have the wrong light on? No, I have the right one. I'm confused. Yay! Hello! I'm pumped. Uh, let me just uh, open up my stream. Open up my game. Audio should be fine. I'm gonna drink some water. Sick! Okay, I am pumped. Hi, hi, it's Misty here. That's me. Good evening if you live on my side of the world, and a very good morning slash afternoon if you live on the other. We're playing some more Witcher 2 today. Um, apologies in advance. I will probably be exploring most of this time and most of the stream. Um, we're in a new area, so I like to go around and pick up side missions and explore, so apologies I'm not really doing main mission stuff. Plus, it's the last chapter anyway, so I kind of want to stretch it out because I won't be able to have any Witcher content after this, and I'm going to miss it. Today I watched... Um, the the Witcher like animation, the one with Vesemir. It was really good. I was surprised actually. It was really, really good. I kind of like put off watching it because the animation style is not really my thing. But I got into watching it and it's really good. So I'm glad I, I made that decision today. So I'm quite pumped. Um, okay, so we're in this tunnel. We came down with Cynthia. We agreed to work with her, not because we wanna but because I would like to um, find out more. Okay, my falca oil is going to run dry soon. Okay, I'm going to put some more falca oil on me. Uh, falca oil. Falca's blood, yeah. Mm -hmm. A great item, awesome. Zeracanian sun, awesome. Okay. Hello. Where the hell am I? Hello. This is just like a lot of iron ore. I can't be bothered with iron ore. I saw a draug somewhere. Should go back in that direction. I think it's on the right. Yeah. Right? Okay. Wish me luck. I have books of all things. Did I actually one shot the Draug? The Draugr? Sorry, I call it Draug. It's Draugr. Oh my god, Ard is fucking wild. Jesus. Ard really does. is really good now. Oh, I'm really liking that. Oh, ho. nice. Draw gear claws. Armor fragment. Very nice. I can make some sort of armor with that, right? Did the Brooksos not drop anything? Okay. Um, cool. Alright, well. That was worth it. I mean, I think there are more tunnels in here that I really should go and explore, but let's follow them first. sword. 
Okay, I'm going to use this one first. Because I need to put upgrades on this before being able to use it. That is a sick sword. Holy crap. Nice. That was the easy part. It can only get more difficult. I'm no rats are run around sewers. What we're looking for, anyway? Some graves, I heard. Graves? So maybe there is something in this forest. Shut your traps. Want the sergeant to hear? We've been deep shot. But it's a good idea. We've got company. Redanian bastard. The entrance must be somewhere here. If here. our experts are to be trusted. De Hanna dabbled in illusions, among other things. Illusions. He also experimented heavily with golems. Nice. Golems with the Thank you for subscribing. Supposedly. Appreciate that. They knew nothing of poetry, but will you two shut up? Yes, I hear a place of power. I found a weak spot. Stand back. Nice. Later. Later, everyone. Lisa and Lorne, later, okay, Which means things are gonna attack me while we wait, I'm gonna assume. Hello. Hello. It's reacting to my spell. Oh, I guess not. I thought things were gonna attack me. Interesting. At times I'm caught. You can get my kind of feet. Though I have no needles, they say I am piercing. What am I? Careful with the answer. Could be a trap. Typical of dear Henna. He was a genius with a penchant for mischievous jokes, like a child. So a couple of adults, purported experts, should have no problem solving this. Indeed, it's trivial. The answer is pain. Incorrect. Oh. No! Impossible! How many years of research together? Well, Why shit. did we ever embark on this? Imagine the books. Well, he's dead. Pleasant or terrible. I come at night or in daytime. Short or long. But yours alone. Essential. I am... Hear that again. Can you please repeat the riddle? Pleasant or terrible. I come at night or in daytime, short or long, but yours alone, essential. I am. Not a day. A dream? Pleasant or terrible, I come at night and at day. Short or long, I am essential. Either a dream or time, right? Time. I don't know. I think it's either of these. Anyone here good at riddles in their youth? Forgive me for sitting this out. Yours alone. Something essential. Time. Time. Time flows. It doesn't come at night or during the day. You're not making sense. But time can be pleasant or terrible. Anything can be pleasant or terrible. But not everything can be short or long. What about a day? We also say my time has come. But it doesn't fit the rest. This isn't a game of forfeits. Our lives are at stake here. A day doesn't come in the night, though. I want to say... A dream. Correct. It's going rather well so far. Amazing. So, yeah. First, I was thinking, like, a shadow, but... Yeah, a dream. I'm glad I went with my instincts and I didn't listen to them. I thought I'm glitched.
Genau. Oh man. Oh lord. Oh lord. Great. <laughs> okay, let's do that again. It's going rather well so far. Not I need to wait for all of them to go in. Okay, nothing here. Too bad about Gaspar. Are you glitched? Are we both glitched? Girl! Are you kidding me? Are we both glitched at the door? This is some bullshit. Let's try that again. My God. It's going rather well so far. Not for everybody. <clears throat> I'm going to meditate and wait for you guys to go in. <coughs> Damn. It all uses blue ingredients, which I don't really have. Doesn't seem like there's anything I can mutate. What the hell are the mutagens for then? No idea. Okay. Are they still stuck there? Okay. Let's meditate for like one hour. Is he not in yet? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. I'm gonna meditate and hope he moves in by the time I'm done. Okay. He should be in by now, right? Thank god. Jeez. Someone's been here recently. Need potions, probably. Drink my usual cocktail. Nice. Hello, Redeemers. Well, well, the competition's here. Kill them.
cannot hope to finish the pursuit alone. A group no. of travelers wandering through the dark. Three guides above them, so three were marked. At night they trailed a drake serpentine and a silver lady shining in fire. If only her visage she would deign to unfold. By day they followed a mountain vault, its riches untold. Did I hear someone complain about the riddles being too easy? Let's think this through. There are nine alcoves, a fresco in each. That's three groups of three frescoes. The riddle mentions three guides above the travelers. We must examine the frescoes, seek answers there. Mm. I'll advise you about the riddle, but I will not take part in disarming the device. I've got a bad feeling about this. Mm. What do you think of the first verse? I would say it describes a serpentine dragon swallowing its own tail, which represents eternity and thus time. The hourglass likewise symbolizes time. In this case, the time of the traveler's journey. I believe it's the dragon constellation. It would be visible at night. Watch more, sources on alchemy invariably portray dragons as winged. And as an accomplished alchemist, Dehenna would also be a competent astrologer. The verse must refer to the constellation. In alchemy, the winged serpentine dragon represents prime matter, an essential component in the process of alchemical transformation. The verse seems to indicate the allegory illustrating that transformation. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait. I will be right back because I heard my cats arguing and I'm worried they're going to like drop a vase or something. So I'll be right back. I'm going to go sort them out. I'll be back in a jiffy. Hello. Yeah, my cats were fighting. Sorry. Oh. I think it's the hourglass. I shall take that one. Hmm? clicked the wrong answer just now. I didn't mean to click it. Let's try it again. A group of... At night, they trailed a drake serpentine and a silver lady shining in fire. If only her visage, she would deign to unfold. By day, they followed a mountain vault, its riches untold. Did I hear someone? Let's think this through. The riddle mentioned. Okay. Look at the frescoes. We got some books.
Mount Anur, Treasure Mountain. Sea Dragon. Sacrifice a Maiden. Luckily for the young woman, a witcher was in the area. Strolling along a beach, he noticed a serpentine beast emerging from the water. He was chained to a seaside rock in less than decent pose. The witcher killed the dragon, freed the woman, and, as chroniclers tell us, plowed her with her consent on the aforementioned rock. This is, um, exactly like... Perseus, right? Is it Perseus? It's either Perseus or Thes Theseus, where he finds a lady. He ends up marrying her. Finds a lady strapped to a rock. There's a sea monster. He kills a sea monster, creates the Red Sea. Fearful last looking west towards Dragon. The Witcher, okay. Demovan's father. Second treasure belonged to the dragon. Okvitz of Quartz Mountain. Also known as the Crystal Mountain or the Mountain of Burning Sands. A group led by Yarkin Sigrind killed the beast and took the treasure, which included sapphire, singular, and diamonds. Sardis cherries. Did he actually kill it? I don't think he did, right? The third is shrouded in mystery. One thing is certain is, is it included ancient artifacts of untold power. Interesting. Okay. A group of travelers wandering through the dark. Three guides above them, so three were marked. At night they trailed a drake serpentine and a silver lady shining and fine. If only her visage she would deign to unfold. By day they followed a mountain vault, its riches untold. say it describes a serpentine dragon swallowing its own tail which represents infinity and thus time the hourglass likewise symbolizes time in this case the time of the traveler's journey i believe it's the dragon constellation it would be visible at night what's more sources on alchemy invariably portray dragons as women Hi. and as an accomplished alchemist Dehenna would also be a competent astrologer the verse must refer to the constellation in alchemy the winged serpentine dragon represents prime matter, an essential component in the process of alchemical transformation. The verse seems to indicate the allegory illustrating that transformation. What do you think of the first verse? I would... I believe in alchemy. Mm -hmm. Can someone remind me how the line was worded? The first verse was... At night, they trailed a drake serpentine. At night, they trailed a drake serpentine. Hello. We just read the book. Uh, and it talks about a dragon. Right, so the three treasures, the dragon, the amber thingy, and the other one is untold. So Treasure Mountain? I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna say the drag- the, the reason- I don't know if these make any sense. I don't know if like, um, the books are supposed to relate to this, but the book talks about three things that are similar to this, so for the serpentine, I'm thinking the dragon because it talks about the dragon being one of the big treasures or like one of the big in the in the treasure book there's one about Demovan's father with the amber 
like decoration thing and then there's one about the dragons with the Ark and Zigrin, and then the third one's untold so I'm gonna I don't know it if this is the right thing dragon constellation. I shall take that one how was your day good or no good it was not bad it was pretty good actually it was an okay day it was an okay day second verse what do you think of the second verse to my mind it speaks of the white rose symbol of the order of the flaming rose you see, the fresco itself resembles a coat of arms, and in heraldry, silver is rendered as white. So the silver lady and white rose are one and the same. I think it describes the full moon. In alchemy, the moon represents both silver as a metal and the feminine element. The order remains largely unknown in the south, so the white rose seems unlikely. Every Nilfgaardian, on the other hand, has heard of the Imperial Nausicaa Brigade, no idea which has is. the Death's Head as its symbol. The Brigade's name is female, and they say Death follows a unit. So the Silver Lady could very well be Nausicaa or the Death's Head. Well, in the book we just read, it talks about the Silver Lady being rescued from the Serpent, and then the Witcher having sex with her. So I'm thinking the Silver Lady, which is what, the full moon? Because it said like her constellation is in the sky next to the dragon. She's looking over to it. Is this a Silver Lady? I think it's the full moon. I'm gonna Allow assume me. the books relate to it. I don't know if they make any I don't know if I'm making any sense. I'm just trying to like, re relate things. What do you say to the third verse? It describes the precipice, the ravine amidst mountains. An ancient rule in alchemy states, as above, so below. The vault is the ravine into which the riches of the mountain flow. We must read the third line literally. To me, it suggests the Mahakam Mountains and its mines, from which dwarves and gnomes extract many ores yeah, that's that are valuable thinking, right? to alchemists. Those mountains are a vault in and of themselves. The verse is not literal. In many legends, towers are in fact vaults, which the hero must penetrate in order to rescue an imprisoned princess or find a long-concealed magic item. I think it's the, the second mountain one. Vault is I'm the trying top. to relate it to the book, so I'm thinking it's the mine entrance. Because I was just saying that. Treasure Mountain or the Opal Mountain or whatever. The mine entrance in the mountainside. That seems logical. I don't know if I'll any of this is making that fresco. sense, but okay. How do I meet... Re meet my ex girlfriend. Your ex girlfriend or your ex girlfriend's friends? I don't know. Was it a good breakup or a bad breakup? If it's a bad breakup, just let it die. If it's a good breakup, sure, you can meet your ex. I've, I've met my ex. I've met a couple of my exes a couple times. Some of them, no. No, no. Never meet them again, but. Some of them were like okay. Were like okay friends. So. Let's see it depends on the this. situation. Take your places. Count me out. I want to live. <laughs> As you will. I think this is right. Let's try it. So where's the mountain one? Is this the mountain? Wait, which one is the mountain? Okay, that's the dragon. That's the time. This is the mountain one, right? No, that's the mountain one. Is that it? Intruder detected. No. Oh. Well, it worked. So, our expedition has grown thin. Huh. Such a shame. I actually found those two. Okay. Here we go. Shut up. Of course, my lady. Hello there. Oh. Hello, sir. Golem? A golem? So dare Hena's legend is true. It is no more than an obedient machine created to follow orders and kill. Not unlike our witcher. Hmm. So I guess we should get along famously. You? What do you know about golems? I don't run into them in every forest, but any good bestiary describes golems at length, and I've read more than my share of those. Geralt, I'm not questioning your knowledge, but I should be the one to... Actually, you are questioning my knowledge. Listen, I know what I'm doing. I'll try to get it to reveal the word that'll deactivate it, or I'll just mess with its head. 
break the code. So now we've got a burglar in our midst. Be my guest. Try. My intentions are good. As are mine. Know, however, that this may change. Derhanna must have been pretty lonely if he gave you eloquence. The Master made me a guardian. Nothing less, nothing more. And you, provided you stand there, are a guest. Hmm. Her eyes are like the time we were together. That depends. What do you want to meet her for? Do you want to just chat and like catch up as friends? Or do you want to like go back and like, you know, be together? Like talk about getting back together or something? Or. Powerful magic created you. Derhanna was a true master. He is still, since his mastery survives. As a conscious being, you must be lonely here. You are wrong. The pain of the world, melancholy, lies within the domain of emotions and feelings. My thoughts are governed by pure logic, restricted by my program. But you can learn. They say that a penchant for philosophy can only come from curiosity. In my case, it comes from the will of the master, who liked to speak with me. And do you feel a need to discuss? I feel nothing. I just have that need. Hmm. Can we discuss the program that controls your behavior? Of course not. Can I ask you for the name word which brought you to life and which can deactivate you? Do that, and I shall consider you an intruder. I have other questions. Did your creator give you a name? I am called Obedience and Unyielding Persistence. I am a guardian and the humblest of servants. A golem's name is the word that gave it life and that can take it away. You must have a name. I own nothing. Everything belongs to my master. How could I divulge the name if I exist solely to protect my creator's property? Do you remember your creator? Of course. I was summoned into being by Master Dehenna. I abide by his will, by his power, by the necessity encased in my stone bowels. Dehenna is dead. His word, which animates me, lives on, as does his legacy, which I protect. Empires will rise and fall. Rivers will shift their courses, but I will remain obedient to one master on my eternal watch. Dear Hannah must have been an exceptional man. Can you tell me about him? I guard everything that belonged to the master, including his privacy, which he valued highly. I can tell you nothing. He wants to get married. Oh, and you don't want to get married. Wait, weren't you married? I'm confused. I was playing Mass Effect yesterday, like, just to see different consequences. I don't know why I keep making the same decisions in all my playthroughs, if I'm playing a game seriously. Because it's based on your morals, so you're gonna play things the same way. Because you, you're, you're trying to answer it the way you would answer it, right? So you would play quite similarly with most games. I have the same issue. You're not an automaton. You're self-aware, and you think you can make decisions. Beep. You're wrong. I am eloquent and can discern between guests and intruders. I can also deal with the latter. But everything I say and do is limited by my restrictive program. By the way, as an automaton, I am immune to all charms. Okay. Stop the uh -oh. intruders. Oof. Uh -oh. We're gonna do this again. I have to figure this out. I figured that the hex wouldn't work, but I wanted to try it. So let's try. Oh. 
Oh no. I have. Wait. Ah! Damn it. I should have paid attention. Oh gosh. Okay. Powerful man. Okay. We've asked these questions. I have. Did you? I'm a gal. I. Do you remember? Of course. Okay. So I'm not gonna do the axie hex. So you're aware you're an automaton. Do you really know who we are, where we came from, and where we are headed? Is human life predictable in that the cycle of birth and death ensnares it better than mine? When a human is born, he is obedient to his parents. Later, he listens to tutors, masters, corporals. Finally, he succumbs to the will of death. And to think that Adelbert questioned Der Hanna's mastery. Hmm. Who, if anyone, is allowed to pass? Der Hanna, but he is dead. Also, guests may pass, but I stop intruders. Tell me more. Who's a guest and who's an intruder? Is it not obvious? A guest keeps his distance, or knows the name word. An intruder is anyone who enters too far, attacks me, or otherwise interferes with my being. Interesting. Has anyone tried to enter before? I recall no intruders. I do, however, remember guests who left after being warned. When was that? What did you discuss? I am a machine. My memory is limited. Fair. You are far more self-aware than a typical golem. Can you make sovereign decisions? The master made me the way I am, because long discussions were to his liking. I can make decisions within my program, of course. So you decide who's a guest and who's an intruder. Who else would? Guests chat innocuously, exerting no pressure. All others are intruders. Hmm. I have other questions. All right, I think I know how to get past this thing without a fight. Burglar witchers, philosopher golems, an expedition replete with fascinating discoveries. And terrible disappointments. Shut up, Adelbear. And you, Witcher, deal with that golem. With Dear Hannah's notes, we can free you. I know you're a guardian and I respect that. I don't think he wants to be freed. We know you exist by the will of your master, thanks to the name so. word he gave you. That is true. As your guest, I would like to know your name. No. He just said that if you ask his name, he'll attack you. You were created to discern intruders oh. from guests. You are to stop the former and greet the latter. Right? Intruders must be stopped. What is this conversation? Let's talk about lies and delusion. What the hell does that mean? I invoke the sacred law of hosp hop hospitality. I mean, I guess that, but this sounds weird. By the sacred rite of hospitality, as a guest, I will now enter this chamber. You are a fool. Customs are a human creation, and no part of my code. Stop the intruders. What? Damn, I was doing so well. No, I gotta do this. What the heck? 
I was so close. I was so close. Okay. Let's do this all again. Okay, I'm just clicking all this so that it's like... I have cataloged. Okay. I have other. Did you? I'm, I got. I got. Pap. Get him off. As a. You, but you. And my. And I. Okay. I have. All right. I think I know Let's how try to get this past again. this thing without a fight. Burglar the lies and delusion one seems weird. I don't know what I'm supposed to ask. An expedition replete with fascinating discoveries. And terrible disappointments. Shut up, Adelbear. And you, Witcher. Deal with that golem. We know you exist by the will of that. You were Am I supposed to say this? Are you aware that intruders may seek to deceive you? I have stone fists to defend myself against those armed with swords. I have my iron logic to defend against those armed with words. But intruders could include sorcerers who alter reality. They could be illusionists or mere liars. What then is certain? My existence is certain, as is my master's will. Nope. Doesn't work on him. Nope, that's not... I'm dear Hannah in disguise and I've been testing you. No. What? If you don't let us pass, you'll die. He'll beat the shit out of us. That is not gonna work. That's not gonna work. Only you and the Master's will exist. Everything else is doubtful. The hell does that mean? Since only you and the Master's legacy exist for certain, everything else is doubtful. A malicious intruder could cloud your senses. I am the Guardian. The Master prepared me for that. He couldn't foresee everything, so he gave you a mind to compensate. You're much more conscious and intelligent than a Guardian needs to be. Your Master says, Greet guests and stop intruders. That is certain, but everything else can be a lie. And you cannot allow yourself to attack guests. That would be against your master's will. Guests must be greeted, and intruders must be stopped. This is Tehenna's will. Are you a guest or an intruder? Doesn't matter what I answer. Your senses deceive you. You can trust only your mind. You can't assume I'm a guest, because I may be an intruder. You can't assume I'm an intruder, because I may be a guest. This is a contradiction, a paradox. The law of excluded middle. We've done it. We've done it. We've done it. We've done it. Let's have a look. What? What? I huh? This is better than I'd hoped. What? A great success for Nilfgaard. What does that mean? I have Maybe no idea what that means. Promotion. Cool, I guess. But what? What did I do? I have no idea what I did. I take everything. Nice. Thanks for the ruins. Appreciate it. Yeah, bacteria strains. Bacteria strains. Can you feel that? My medallion's vibrating. Another masking illusion. I'll try to disperse it. Later. Later, Elorn. Lisa Elorn. Later, dear. Death describes finding a more dominant than the friends. Okay. The device. What is it? You've done your job. You'll be paid and... Paid like the scholars were? They died once they were no longer useful. They were never useful, but Cynthia insisted. Fortunately, they were so kind as to remove themselves without my help. I'm not about to be that kind. Adelbear, you know what you're to look for. Yes, ma'am. It's a prototype megascope. I didn't know it had survived. What's it do? The that was some serious takes an emotional I have no idea person. what the hell I did. Its user need only I did something. Person and the device will I don't even know how that worked. Great I don't even know what it did. I don't know. Yes. Time you I don't even know what that paradox party. was. What do you know about my past? I mean, I get it, but it, it was just like it. It made no sense in the you sense of trying to make. You were a rider of the wild hunt. I read the reports. 
Don't the Nilf Guardians have anything better to do than write reports about witchers? Not about witchers. About you. You are the sole person to have been a member of the Host. And survived. Anything else? Any detail you can give me would be useful. Don't trust Letho. You think I trust the people I hunt? He's your foe today, but he wasn't always. Is there anything to prove I was part of the Wild Hunt? Nothing. Apart from the fact that Nilfgaardian intelligence agents are drawn and quartered for lying in their reports. Hmm. An enlightened nation indeed. You haven't the faintest notion how many people are interested in you. Very important people. Just because I survived? You're a former rider of the hunt, and you live. You may be the key to solving the mystery of the retinue, and oh, they the all know that. You must watch out for yourself. How do you know I knew Letho? I've read... The reports, I know. Why are you warning me about him? Because I like you. That's all. Let's say you've satisfied my curiosity. Well then, consider me glad to have satisfied a witcher, whatever the way. All right, we're even. I can't let you leave with that thing. I'd like to try the artifact. I'd like to try the artifact. I'd like to try out the device. You realize that can only end badly. Cut in again and I'll put you in my report. You may use it, but just once. Giving state secrets away to a Nordling. Will you mention that in your report? You're sure to be named a commander one day, Adelbert. But until that happens, be a good boy and do your job. Article 22 of the Code is clear. Suspicion of treason is sufficient grounds to strip a commander of power. Article 1 of my personal code is equally clear. Traitors must be subjected to the most painful death possible. Multiplication. Second year at the academy, all majors learn it. I didn't expect you to take my side. Well, now choose one person you wish to contact. After that, the artifact's mine. How do you? I've read the report. Oh, right. Because I is not. Hmm. You have just because I serve. You. Okay, we've already. Let's. Well, we've already heard this. Nilf Guardian agents get quartered for lying in reports. What does the Empire do to agents who kill their colleagues? Nothing. As long as no one finds out. Hmm. Will we meet again? I wouldn't mind at all. Look for me at the inn. Hmm. Once you encounter a Gaunt or a Dim, you can't consider Wild Hunt a serious threat. They start looking like some elves in fancy armors. They look so cool in their armor, but once they take off their helmets, it's so underwhelming. I'm like, oh, okay. Cool, I guess. They have really sick armor, but other I'd than that... I'd appreciate it if you didn't eavesdrop while I eavesdropped. I shan't trouble you. I have a lot of work to do here. Think of Triss. Think of Radovid. Think of Vernon. Think of Dandelion. Why would I want to know what Dandelion is doing? Saskia would be a good one. Trish. 
Tris. Tris would be a good one so I know where she is. Vernon would be good because he's... I mean, I don't think he would betray me though, right? I don't really need to see this. I don't feel like that would help. I either want to do Saskia or Triss. Saskia or Triss, what do we think? Uh, Vernon is not super interesting to me. Saskia or Triss? Saskia. I made sure we'd have a trustworthy cook while in Loch Muin. I'll not allow anyone to slip poison into your goblet here. I cannot sit here and eat in peace while Philippa rots in a dungeon. Regardless of Philippa's whereabouts and predicament, you must behave as befits a queen. Oh, she's with Sheila. Does that rule out caring for my friends? Philippa will manage. And even should she fail, I'm sure her final wish would be that we follow through with the plan. So eat. You must be at full strength during the summit. A very important task awaits you. Interesting. I hope you learned something useful. Mm. I'm just sorry I can't use the artifact a few more times. Its power has been depleted. I understand. Thanks anyway. Diana's notes from a Diana's notes about the city's history. Oh, the drog one does so much better, though. Quilted leather. I could just sell all this stuff. Um... Uh... Oh, look at the damage it does. Wild. The Wild Hunt is clearly inspired by Nazgul's from Lord of the Rings, and trust me, Nazgul's are way cooler than the Wild Hunt. It's not even close. Well, the legend of the Wild Hunt has been around in, like, fairy tales and stuff like that for the longest time. In legends and stuff, but design-wise, I don't know. But the story about, like, the Wild Hunt, and, like, the Wild Hunt legend, has been around for a while, because we've seen it in, like, other... other games as well. Uh, not other games, other franchises as well. Whoa, I can't click my escape button. Hello? What the? I want to save. Why can't I hit my escape button? What the? Oh, does F5 save my game? Oh, okay, good. Quick save. Nice. I got everything. Return to the surface. Remain in the laboratory. I'll find my way out. I feel like there was some stuff that I did not explore fully. I want to go and check it out. Poor guy.
Let's see, what do we have down here? Okay. There's a lot of... Okay. What should I upgrade? iron ore okay got all the stuff down here let me just text my partner real quick i want to check if they're on the way home okay. which way did we come from that way not expect that. Yeah. Okay. Why am I always carrying too much? What is too heavy? Is it this? some potions. The usual, the usual. I personally think it would be very better if they didn't show us the face of the wild hunt as it kind of took away the mystery factor. Yeah, exactly. That's what I think too. They look so cool and so, um, 
what's the word? Intimidating. Oh, hello. Too much weight. I'm gonna continue to drop some stuff. Sure, we'll drop like down. Drop. Oh. So, there's no point for me to go back in really, is there? Right? I mean, unless I want more drug or stuff, which I don't really need. I already went this way. Let's go back. I feel like there was a tunnel around the area that I came from from that I didn't fully explore. Or did I explore it all? I don't know. In case I didn't. Okay, maybe I did explore it all. Yeah. I guess I don't know. Uh, maybe I need to figure that out later. <laughs> Apologies. Okay. Let me try something. My, like, game is not 
allowing me to click like the menu button, which is really weird. No. some stuff to do. The gargoyle contract. I need to go fight some more gargoyles. One sec. Let's go do the gargoyle one first. Oh, I really should put this away. Mm -hmm. Let's go sell some stuff first. Where's the armorer? Sell you this. Yeah, bruh. Ankle biter. Shatter your tower. Eight for one? That's crazy. Jeez. Okay. Break your wands and burn your hat. Okay. Turn away the black cat. You found and something funny? What is it? And the rat. Where's the innkeeper? Sleep. Oh. oh. Freak. Wonderful phrase. Oh, I have like notifications on my camera, like in my, on my door. So I can check, something's moving. Okay. My partner is back. She did not message me. I had to look on my camera. Okay. Where the heck is the innkeeper? Will they see me run up there? Whee! Nope. Okay, nothing to see here. Hi, we need to talk. Found of Cynthia course. about the. You had me fooled back in Vergen. That sweet face of yours. Never suspected it could belong to someone who fanatically believes in conquering the North. Mock me if you must, but I truly believe one huge empire is humanity's only hope. Many nations under one crown, with shared laws, advanced science, 
burgeoning industry and trade, and no wars, of course. Sounds great. Let me know when it works out. Hm. I'd gladly spend my old age in a land like that. These ruins must hold many secrets. I'm certain of that. It was a beautiful city. A city full of talent and hope. But that ill ended with the coming of the Nordling armies. Think the city would have survived if those armies had been Imperial? Your king started the war with the Enshe. Nilfgaard's relations with the Elves have always been peaceful. They really did a job on your brain. That was an interesting adventure, Cynthia. Yes. People bond over experiences like that. Yeah, kind of makes you wonder what happened back in Vergen. Did you get your promotion? Not yet, but His Imperial Majesty rewards dedication. Can he discern the truth from lies? What do you mean? I take it the Emperor has no idea his sorceress helped a mutant kill a Nilfgaardian mage. It was a dangerous expedition. Casualties were inevitable. He'll content himself with that. <laughs> Got time to talk? Or are you off on another dangerous mission? Even we Nilfgaardian agents rest sometimes. <laughs> Used the artifact yet? I'm working on improving it. I think it'll be useful one day. Interesting. I found some of Derhenna's notes. He studied the history of the Vrans, right? Among other things. He makes several mentions of an epidemic. Loch Muin conceals Covid. many more secrets than we imagined. I doubt we'll ever know all of them. Well, if Derhenna is to be trusted, the epidemic had something to do with the Enshe. Maybe the Vrans caught the disease from the Elves. I'm no expert on diseases, Witcher. Who knows? Perhaps Dare Henna was right, and the decline of Vrani civilization was much darker and more sudden than we thought. You play as a female, okay. There's someone thirsty for your boy. Suggests a threesome just to get, okay. But if you play as a male, that female squad mate is madly in love with you, and if you try to double date, she gets sad and tells you she doesn't want to share you. Double date? You mean like polyamorous relationship? Or do you mean like go on a double date? You knew what we'd find in that laboratory. Come again? You wanted the bacteria strains that killed the Vrans. Or more precisely, Derhenna's notes from his research into them. This is very dangerous knowledge. I suspect that's exactly why the Emperor is so interested. The North is in chaos. An epidemic is the last thing you need. And one could break out if Dare Henna's book fell into the wrong hands. Fortunately, it's now in the right hands. In Emir's civilized and manicured hands. Precisely. Hmm. Interesting. I'm finding it hard to believe anything you say. Did you come here to insult me? Uh, no. Sorry. What exactly do you want? I was curious. I wanted to see which Cynthia I'd meet this time. The spy, the sorceress, or maybe the woman. Which were you hoping to meet? The real one. Let's assume you're speaking to her. How do you like her? Let's say I like her quite a bit. Compliments are clearly not your forte. I just told you why I've come. Care to tell me why you invited me? Let's say I was interested to see which Geralt would show up. Oh, right, like dating multiple people. Uh... What? Uh... Should I... Should I, for the hell of it, just sleep with her? Why not? I don't really care for Triss, to be honest. Fuck it. Thanks, but I have a wife and kids. Oh, I silly didn't game, Witcher. That. Very silly. Huh. Farewell, and good luck. I did not mean to click that. Leave the royal it's that courts. albino again. Venom uh, ears no more. Hold on. It's not too late. Okay, I need to close my game because um, my game is actually glitched. And I can't actually access my menu. Okay, let me just restart my game. For some reason, I couldn't access my menu. What? 
unable to sync. Oh, that's probably why I couldn't access my menu. Okay, let me resync my game real quick. Why does this always happen? Let me do this again. Properties. Uh huh. Give me a sec. She wants female player to share her boyfriend, but doesn't want to share her boyfriend. Ah, uh, the possessive territorial type. I see. Okay, hold up. I'm like. Yellow. Yeah. Hello. I'm um, validating my Steam files. Because for some reason my game was kind of glitched. And then it wouldn't synchronize. So I need to recheck this again. Yeah, we gotta give it a sec. I'm excited to play Hellblade after this, though. I'm very excited to play Hellblade. I haven't looked into it at all. I've watched the trailers and stuff, but... I haven't looked into it at all because I want to be excited and I want to be, like, fresh going into it. So... <laughs> Shouldn't she know witchers are sterile so Geralt, def so Geralt definitely doesn't have kids? Uh, I think she knows he was joking. Right? I assume that she knew he was joking. She was like, ah, ha, ha, so you don't want me. You're just being a slut. <laughs> That's what I assumed. Okay, let me let me try this again. See if it works. Okay, it should work now. Awesome sauce. All right, all right, all right. There we go. Okay. But yes, I am sad to be done with The Witcher, but I'm also very excited to start a new game. Um, I start Hellblade because it looks super dope. I just haven't gotten like into checking out a lot of stuff about it because I want to be surprised. Okay, let's see. Where was my last save? Okay. So it did save. Okay. How many hours do you sleep in a day? It depends. Right now, I'm not sleeping that much because I have a lot of work. So, like, I don't know. Oh, um, maybe six hours average. Five, six hours average. I don't really get to sleep eight hours that often. Deadly yourself, pauper. Shatter your towers and crystal balls. Break your wands and burn your hats. Turn away the There she is. Oh, is that the inn? It's a brazen attack. Okay, let's put... Let's put all this stuff away. I'm not really using it. Put all these trophies away as well. Goodbye, Harpy. Okay. That's heavy, that's heavy. This way. That away, yeah. Andrega hide is heavy. Let's see. Iron ore. Okay, let's put all this stuff away. When I need it, I'll come get it. <laughs> Madam, it sent them, you idiot! The audacity! Pull yourself together! Hey, what the heck? 
The, we the need voice to talk. actor sounds like Anna Ferguson. Of course. Okay. You had me. F You're Let's try and do the that tang with her. Yeah. yeah did Not. Can what do you mean? I it was a dangerous ex. Go. Even. You. This is a suspect. For. You. I. What? I I'm finding it hard to believe anything you say. Did you come here to insult me? Uh, Allowing no. the light to bow Sorry. gracefully, that's fair. <laughs> what exactly do you want? Sure, I let's do the tang with her. Compliment. I just told. Let's. Because maybe I if I hook up with her, oh Cheryl Jesus! Would show up. And that was some Brooks type shit. Yeet. Um, maybe if I get it on with her, I can like look through her stuff and find something. Am I gonna see titties? Hmm? Oh yeah. Mm. Oh gosh, I'm gonna see titties. Oh. Jesus! Why? Why did get the titties out of here? Oh my lord. I mean, titties are great. Gotta love them. But come on now, we're on YouTube. Oh Jesus. Okay. The minstrels got it right. Women of the South are both passionate and clever. Okay, okay. I like to improvise. Yeah, I noticed. The fail. Okay. Let me get my. Okay, we just slept together. I thought we would get something cool out of that, but no. Nope, we didn't. We just. Okay. Tris is gonna be mad at me. So is Philippa. Oh, God. Just let me access my task manager screen. Holy Jesus. One sec. I'm trying to access my task manager screen because. And if Grandma had a mustache, she would be a catfish. Oh my god, stop. Sorry, I'm trying to access my. Um, like streaming screen and I have to change my mouse over by using task manager but it's just a pain in the ass are you gonna play Hellblade alone till you finish it or will you play something else along with it um I think currently I'll probably play just Hellblade first because the thing is like I don't have as much time as I used to to stream um so oh god where did my mouse go shit I need to move the thing eight Need to move the boobs. Oh my god. Please just let me. Okay. There we go. In my personal experience, yes, you see Tata's during sex. I also have that personal experience. Um, but uh, I, you, you know what I mean? Exactly. Um, I, I do want to play two things alongside each other but because i don't have that much time currently like i'm not streaming like i used to i used to stream like four hours a day and i would stream like six days a week but Where is because Philippa? of work now and she because... should reason with this brat. shush i'm talking um but because of like me now going down to like two hours a day to stream and i don't stream as often as i used to because my work schedule is kind of all over the place i don't know if i should stream two games at the same time or will it feel like too sparse for you guys I don't know. Let me know what she you guys think. She should pull down his pants and give him a thrashing in front of all those knights. <coughs> I don't want anything mm -hmm. to do with you. Let me know what you think. I still grab. Tarzan! Don't open the door! Hi, uh... Nosy bastard. Love him, though. But... Hello, child. You fat brat. Hello everyone, it's Tarzan. Oh my god, Tarzan, what is this? Tarzan, what is this? What is... Okay, okay, okay. Oh Jesus. Oh god, oh lord, ow! Tarzan. Get your butt back here. Show everyone your handsome face. Show it. Don't show them your private parts. Tarzan, say hi to everyone and then I'm gonna throw you. Hi! What? Hi. Okay, bye!
You can go now. You wanna go or you wanna stay here? You wanna stay here? No, you don't. Go on. Bye. Oh god! Ugh! I have. I have fur all over me. Help. Hellblade is a very short game. It takes you less than a week. Okay. Damn. That is quite short. Um. Yeah, just let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think I should play two games at the same time? Or should I just do one? If I play two games at the same time, then it'll be like the Shadow series and Hellblade. Ten hours? Oh. oh. Okay. Can I like stretch it out to like 20? The way I do with this stuff? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go back here. I'm gonna find a way to go back to that direction. In order to fight the gargoyles again. Uh, this direction? Is it? Yeah. There we go. I need to fight the gargoyles, so come at me, homies. Yup. Welcome. Come on, gargoyles. Tarzan sighting. I know, right? My partner is such a softie for him. She definitely has a favorite son. Um. So, before, remember when I told you, like, moving here, um, the cats would not be allowed in the bedroom, um, in the streaming room, or in the, any other room besides our own? Well, that's changed miraculously. Now Captain sleeps with us. Tarzan comes and spends most of his day outside and in the bedroom. Um, and all, all those, like, you know, changes, not because of me. <laughs> it's because someone... Could not say no to Tarzan's cute eyes. And it ain't me. Exactly, Tarzan. It's your mother. Exactly. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. Oh, hello. There should be some gargoyles here, right? Nope, this is the inn. They should come down here. Come on. There we go, Adelaide. How many more will turn up? Learn more about gargoyles. I am killing a lot of them, but. Hopefully that helps me learn more about gargoyles. Kill the golem down here. I wonder if I can figure out the symbols. Will the golem reappear? That'll be annoying. No, it doesn't. Okay. Let me read this and try and figure it out. Glittering fish dying on a fresco struck by lightning. Glittering fish dying on a fresco struck by lightning.
glittering fish dying on a fresco struck by lightning. Glittering fish. A scythe? Glittering fish dying on a fresco struck by lightning. So that one. Dying on a fresco. What does a dying one look like again? A scythe. And then... Lightning bolt. A scythe. Like understanding it properly. Glittering fish dying on a fresco struck by lightning. Rune of Thunder is a faithful representation of a, st a striking lightning bolt. Dying fish. No, glittering fish. Which one looks like a snake? I have no idea. That one? I can't tell which one is supposed to look like which. That's my problem. This one looks like lightning, I guess. I don't know. I'm very confused. How do I decipher it? I don't understand. These symbols are fucking weird. Anyways, I'm gonna go kill some more gargoyles. There's a shit ton of gargoyles over there. The other side. Yeah, and the other door. So let's go check it out. One thing you have to do with Hellblade after completing the game, make sure you watch and react to the Hellblade featurette included. Very powerful. Okay. Cool, cool. Sounds cool. Drinks and potions. Okay. Why not? Lock me in. I have a lot of cat fur on me. Hey y'all. Gate, Siegfried? Yeah, probably. Let's go fight some gargoyles. Okay. I'm getting sleepy, apparently. I'm gonna play for another 20 minutes and then call it a day. Fight some gargoyles.
Did I get all of them? How many gargoyles do I need to kill? Killing a bunch of gargoyles. Any more? No? Okay. Still have no idea how to figure these out. A doze long shadow, the moon quietly moans. It is autumn already. A doze long shadow, the moon quietly moans. It is autumn already. The moon quietly moans. Those long shadow. This one? This one? Weather is an arrow sliced in half. Dunes long shadow. A doe's long shadow. It's a snake. Snake. Do I have to use one for each, one book for each of them? Yeah, because they're all the same. So... Oi. This is hard to figure out, yo. Arrow sliced in half. That's the last one. Snake creeping along a river. Arrow 
narrow slice in half. I don't know, bro. I did it. Good. Nice. God, it's hard to figure out. Okay. Hey, Tarzan. I'll be... I don't know. I'm glad we figured one out. My god. Okay, I need to go back to the other area. I need more gargoyles. What a pain in my ass. Hey, Tarzan. Yeah. Sorry, that took me a while. Kind of hard to figure out. Try and figure this one out again. I would like. There they come. Hey. Monsters. I'm not learning enough about them yet at this point. Okay. Glittering fish dying on a fresco, struck by lightning. Glittering fish. Dying on a fresco, struck by lightning. Oh! Dying on a fresco must be art, right? I'm an idiot, sorry. I didn't realize that. Fuck. Okay. Let's try this again. What is this? Resembles a harp. Okay. And then dying on a fresco struck by lightning. Okay, so a lightning bolt and then um, a glittering fish. Glittering fish. What the fuck is a glittering fish? Hello? What does that mean? Glittering fish. Glittering fish. So a harp, a lightning bolt, and a snake. Snake, harp, lightning bolt. That looks like a harp. Right? And that looks like light. Is this the glittering fish? Like it just looks like the glittering fish. Fresco. Or is this a glittering fish? It's supposed to be literal. 
door. Okay, let's try this again. It is not that long, so I think it would be better to finish first. Okay. Point. Art. Lightning. What the hell is a glittering fish? That's what I need to figure it out. What what does it represent? Unless that's not the lightning bolt. Unless that's the lightning bolt. I don't think so. don't even care. Stream two games would make what? Ah! I need to do this again. I'm so confused. I really can't. I really don't understand. Oh, it's part of the Gargo contract? Really? Oh, no way. I didn't know that. So I am getting them right. Okay, so I do kind of know them right. I have them right in my head, so I don't know why I'm not figuring it out. So that's the animal, so the snake thing. Or is it... Struck by lightning. Is struck by lightning like death? And not actually thunder? Not the lightning bolt? But is it maybe like death? There's a death one, right? Hey, where is it? Here! Yeah. I sighed? I have no idea. Am I reading them wrong? I could be reading them wrong. I don't mean. so confused. Glittering fish dying on a fresco struck by lightning. 
glittering fish has to be this one. This is the only way. This is the animal one. Now. Struck on fresco. Is it not art? Is it death? Is it dot? Well, he's not dead. Dying? Is it time? Dying on a fresco. So dying. Jesus. Am I supposed to figure out three ruins from the book or four? Because I've been figuring out three, like one for each phrase, but maybe I need to find all four. Dying on a fresco and then art. And then struck by lightning. How is that lightning? Is it? How is it lightning? I'm so confused. Parallelogram. Rune of the sky. Is lightning a sky? And not thunder? That is weird. Why is it not thunder? Or striking a lightning bolt. Or maybe that is the lightning bolt? It looks like a bolt. Weird. Okay, anyways. Arch. Just fresco, right? And then this. Oh god. Oh shit, it worked. Oh my god, that is some bullshit. Are you kidding me? That is some bullshit. Oh lord. Okay, and then there's one more in inside, I remember. Why are you everywhere? There's one inside Loch Queen, like in the city. Is it weird that this quest is making me hungry? Huh? How? How is it making you hungry? What about it is making you hungry? That's interesting. Ugh, so weird. The symbols are just hard for no reason. Come on! Also, after you will get familiar with Nazgul through Shadow Games. And they're so cool. You'd want to be them. Okay. I'm excited. I'm excited. Okay. So I guess I need to go deactivate the one inside the village now. Where was it again? Oh, Jesus. Hi. What? Okay, I remember seeing it. Go for some seafood. Oh, I'm sorry. It's the glittering fish. I'm oh. so sorry. Is it this thing? Renounce magic, I tell you. Shatter your towers and crystal ball. Jesus. Watch it. Whoops. Did not mean to do that. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Did not mean to walk into that. I apologize deeply. Whoopsies. Did not mean to do that. I'm so sorry. Okay, where's the tunnel? Is this the tunnel?
Oh, this is the Philippa tunnel. No, this is not what I'm looking for. I remember going into the room when I got here the first time, so I, I should be able to find it. I'm just gonna find that rune and then call it a day. Where is that? Is it in here? No. Oh, freak! <laughs> hey, you rude bastard. Where was it? Hell was it? Oh man. I'm terrible with directions. I apologize. It's almost noon here. I need lunch soon either way. That's fair. I, I should go to bed soon as well. But I'm just very confused as to where the hell this room is. Because I know I found it. I remember finding it and I was like, oh, there's three. There must be four. For some reason, I thought there would be four. But I saw it. I know I saw it. Is it around here? Prepare for your final lesson. Final? But I'll have no discussion. It must be. Down there? Yeah. Hello, gargoyles. <laughs> oh, of course. You bastard. Damn it. Hearts. Like literally. Okay. Finally, the last one, and then I can finally save. Okay, here it is. There's a golem here, right? Did I kill it? Yeah, I did. Okay. What's the last one? On the dark sky, the beauty of the falcon's flight faster and faster. Dark sky. So sky, falcon, faster is time. Okay, do I need to figure out four runes? I'm going to try and figure out four runes. Okay, so dark sky. Sky is the parallelogram one, the lips one. And then beauty, is that uh, the harp? Beauty and then the snake. And then the hourglass. So it goes the sky. This, this. It's the animal. The sky is this one. Mm -hmm. And then it's the harp, the beauty. I better be right. And then it's the animal. And then it should be time. It's faster. God, I hope I'm right. Oh my god, I'm right. Oh, I did it. Holy shit. Ooh. If you hold the sword of Aramil, you defy his king's rule. The lord of the wild hunt desires the gene of the elder blood. 
he seeks to fling open the gates between the worlds so that terror and destruction may reign. The king of the hunt ordered me slain, and the wraiths born of his command assumed living form, pursuing me through the voids between the worlds for centuries. I have arrived at Loch Muin. Though tired, I know I will not rest. The riders of the hunt draw near. On my back, I can feel their deathly breath. Nice. Okay. Very cool. I can make this armor, which is very cool. Sick sword. Oh. Nice. Oh. I'm getting so many cool swords. Okay. I'm gonna call it a day here. Today was very, very fun. We got a lot done, although it wasn't any main missions. Um, we got the side missions done. I'm sorry it took so long on the runes. It was very confusing. But we got there in the end. Um, so I think I only have one. I don't even know if I have any side quests left. If I do, I have like one. And then we're just gonna do main quests. And then we're gonna be done. Let's say two more streams and we'll probably be done with The Witcher and then we'll jump into Hellblade. In that case, what I'm seeing is I should play Hellblade first, finish it off, and then play Shadow along with something else because Shadow is a longer game. Um, so I'll do that. All right. Have a great night if you live on my side of the world um, and have a great day if you live on the other. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's stream. I really enjoyed it. It was super duper fun. Just chill. Me running around exploring as usual. That's what happens when I'm in a new area. <laughs> so yeah. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for joining me today. Um, I'll be home super late tomorrow. But I'll try and stream for a little bit. Um, so yeah. Thank you so much for joining me. And I will see you guys super duper soon. Once again, it's Misty here. And I'm signing off. Take care. Stay safe. All that good good. And bye bye If I can get my mouse. My gosh. My cursor. There we go. <laughs>